The deadly crash is also causing a big traffic mess during the rush hour. The crash happened right between the Intracoastal Waterway Bridge and San Pablo Boulevard. Channel 4's Vic Michelucci has been keeping us updated from that scene. He joins us live right now with the very latest. Vic. Lindsay, a very tragic situation here. A lot of Jacksonville Sheriff's Office traffic homicide detectives are trying to find out exactly what happened. They said right now they are still waiting to unravel the story from the witnesses that are still here on scene. We have seen investigators talking with them over the past hour. This happened shortly before 4.30 right here on Beach Boulevard on the base of the Intracoastal Waterway Bridge. It happened in the right lane. I did speak with a Jacksonville Sheriff's Office lieutenant. His name is Jimmy Judge, and he told me that a pedestrian, a young man, possibly in his teens, maybe early 20s, was hit when for some reason and he was in the right lane of traffic here. The vehicle, a white uh, termite or pest control vehicle, still here on the scene, as well as several other witnesses. Take a listen to Lieutenant Judge. Any word on who this person is, age, what happened? No, sir. We don't have, we haven't made identification yet. Obviously, if we haven't done that, we haven't been able to not notify any next of kin. Um, right now, we've got some witnesses sequestered. We've got the driver sequestered. We're trying to interview them and figure out exactly what did happen. Is the driver cooperating with police at this point? Yes, ma'am. Very much so. He's shaken up, obviously, but he's, he's, he's being very cooperative with us. And that's the man in that white, some sort of work truck? Yes, sir. He's in a white. It looks to be some kind of pest control truck or something up there on the apex of the ICW. Hey, So we're hearing a lot of different scenarios about what might have happened from people who live in this neighborhood. Right now, those are just rumors waiting for police to confirm. As soon as we have that information, we will pass it along to you. In the meantime, I highly recommend you stay away from Beach Boulevard eastbound. That's because only one lane is open right now. Traffic backed up for several miles, also spilling over onto San Pablo. So if you need to get out to the beach, I recommend taking JTB eastbound or Atlantic Boulevard. Live in San Pablo, Vic Michelucci, Channel 4, The Local Station.